Saiful bin Sardin, I'm the team leader of this team. Today, we will show the experiment of diffusion of tea bag in hot and cold water. Before that, I will introduce my team member. Assalamualaikum, my name is Nur Intan Shafika binti Muhammad Jamil. Assalamualaikum, my name is Nur Adhika binti Abdullah. Assalamualaikum, my name is Nur Naja Anisha binti Muhammad Jibi. Assalamualaikum. Today, me and my friend we discuss about the equimolar counter diffusion in liquid diffusion. Before that, we must know and understand what is mass transfer. Mass transfer is the net movement of a component in the mixture from one location to another where the component exists at different concentration. This phenomenon is called diffusion. What is diffusion? Diffusion is the one specific move from a region of higher concentration to the region of lower concentration. Molecular diffusion move in three phases, which is solid, liquid, and gas. Now, I will go through more specific of liquid phase. In liquid phase, we have two conditions, which is equimolar counter diffusion in liquid diffusion and diffusion of a true non diffusion B in liquid diffusion. My friend will explain more detail through the video. The title of the video is Equimolar counter diffusion in liquid diffusion by using the bed. First, my team member had told about the topic that have been chosen to present to you all. The title of the topic is Equimolar Counter Diffusion in Water Using Tea Bags. Maybe many of you are asking why we choose this topic. We choose this topic because we see that this topic can give clear imagination to us about mass transfer. This mostly obey fixed law. What is fixed law? Hmm. This law is defined as diffusion of molecule when the whole bulk fluid is not moving but is stationary. Diffusion of the molecule is due to a concentration gradient. So, what we, what we can conclude from this topic? Firstly, we need to prepare two glasses of hot and cold water and also two seconds of tea bag. At the same time, put the tea bags into the glass. After a few seconds, we will see the tea bag in the hot water diffuse rapidly. Compare the cold water. To get the clear observation, Put a F4 paper as a background.
we will talk about the conclusion. The conclusion of this experiment are the tea bag will always diffuse no matter the temperature of of water because particles are always motion. This happens because the different in concentration of particles of the tea in the tea bag are higher than in the water. So the particle of the tea will diffuse in water. That's all our presentation. Bye and Assalamualaikum.